We just don't assemble as a community like we once did, so finding practical purposes for buildings with big uh, assembly volumes inside can take time. The Scottish Rite Cathedral is a rare and early example of poured concrete architecture in Tacoma and dates from 1922. Designed by the acclaimed Tacoma architecture firm Sutton, Whitney, and Dugan, the building's style defies easy categorization. One of the first things you notice about a building is what it looks like, and we sometimes pass judgment on the style and if we like it or if we don't like it, but buildings actually have a lot more value um, than just their architectural style. Our buildings and our the design of our communities make each city and place unique. It anchors a prominent corner lot across from Wright Park in Tacoma's historic stadium district and has served as a fraternal hall, an events venue, and a church. The Scottish Rite Cathedral represents a larger issue of concern witnessed in urban areas across the country. The current congregation is unable to maintain the building, and due to the high land value, a prospective developer plans to tear it down in the name of increased density. To complicate matters, religious-owned properties are exempt from local preservation ordinances in Washington state, which clears the path for demolition. What's happened with the Scottish Rite building is that it currently belongs to a religious congregation. And um, the developers, this has happened elsewhere, the developers want the building gone. They approach the congregation about using their status as a religious organization to avoid landmark protections and go ahead and have the building demolished. I would like to see Tacoma really tap into that developer network who are preservation friendly, who recognize the value in the opportunities in, in keeping and using old buildings. You know, I feel like Tacoma cares about history. We care about creativity and encouraging small businesses and, and you know, buying local and supporting local artists and preservation fits hand in hand with that.